hey, you're here to get your ear pierced, right? Okay, so the first thing I'm supposed to do is get your name and your birthday and information like that, but I kind of just want to get this appointment over with, so we're going to skip that part. The next thing I'm supposed to do is inspect your ears. So I have this little um, magnifying glass thing. I don't know if we do that. Little cap. The reason we do this is because if we pierce an infected ear, it will oftentimes get infected and then we'll get sued and it's just really annoying. So yeah, I'm pretty sure I'm going to have to clean your ears because they look disgusting even from here. I'll check them anyways though. You could just look to the back of the room, I don't really care. Try not to move. Okay, yeah, I was right. Your ears are really gross and I need to clean them. Thanks a lot. Uh, to do this, I have this liquid. It says straight up cleansing on it. So I'm just going to pour a couple of drops of this into both of your ears and after a couple of minutes, they should be uh, clean. Try not to move, otherwise I'm going to have to do this again and I don't want to have to do this again. I'll start with your left ear. should be good. While that's doing its thing, we're going to go over the five piercing options that we offer uh, so I can figure out what piercing I'm going to give you today. So I have this picture of an ear. I'm just going to draw on the various piercings that we offer. So the first one is just your standard low piercing. If you've never gotten a piercing before, you should probably start with this one. The next one is uh, an upper lobe piercing, so just like slightly higher. And then the third one we offer is a tragus piercing. This one goes right here on the little flappy part of your ear, if you can see right here, this thing. Um, that one's a little more painful than these two right here. This one is probably the least painful, the standard lobe. The next one we offer is a helix piercing, so this one goes right here. People oftentimes refer to this one as a cartilage piercing, but the like official name is Helix. And then the last one that we offer is an industrial piercing. So this one will just go through the top of your ear, kind of like this. It's like a little bar. This one is really painful and it has a hard time healing, but you can put little like designs here or like little pendants so I've seen people with like a Hello Kitty one it kind of looks like that um so yeah those are the five we offer uh which would you like to get today okay I don't have all day so I'm just going to pick for you uh I think we'll get the just standard one for you since you have no piercings. Okay, I think the cleansing uh, solution should be done. Now we're going to relax your ears because if I don't, then this will be extremely painful and you'll probably scream. And I really hate when people scream, it's just really annoying. So yeah, to do that, relax your ears, I have this little solution right here. And then I have this massaging stick. So first I'm going to pour some of this onto your ears. Uh, try not to move. Other side. Okay. And then now I'm going to massage your ears with this little stick. You could close your eyes if you want. So I'm just going to put my hand behind your ear and then massage it with this stick.
Okay, that should be good. Now we're going to finally pierce your ears. So here's the needle that I use. It's not very big, so it's nothing to be afraid of. If you need to, you can hold my hand for like comfort. Just kidding. Uh, you wish. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, please don't scream. It's kind of a slow process, so. Okay, done with one side. Now I'm going to do the other. Okay, that's it. Um, I hope that wasn't too painful. Now that we've done that, we have to put some earrings in your ears. So I have this little container of earrings. I'll show you a couple. So you can mix and match if you want. Uh, here's one. There aren't two of these, so you're gonna have to mix and match if you choose this one. But I have this little, um, toothless from how to train your dragon uh toothless earring so it just dangles kind of like that the next one i have is this axolotl i think is what it's called it's like a pink little sea creature thing that one dangles also uh here's another one we have uh shudikin i think it's pronounced earrings it's not super sharp, don't worry. It's just like a piece of plastic. This one also dangles. I have this little crocheted flower with a little bead on the bottom. Very cute. I think this was handmade too. Next one is this little boba earring. This one's really cute. It even has little boba, bobas in it, boba balls, I don't know what it's called. Uh, next is this little sword thing. This one's super cool. I really like this one. So for all of these earrings, there are two, except for um, these ones. These ones are, there are only one of them. So do you have a preference or do you want me to pick this for you too? I'll hold up all the options. I don't know if you can even see this super well. So the crocheted flower, the knight, the shuriken, boba, sword, axolotl, toothless. Okay, yeah, great choice. I really like the boba earrings. side. Okay, that's it. I'll see ya.